Watch it, watch it! Football last world! Football hooligan world! Double Diablo, Diablo TV, like, subscribe, do things you're supposed to do. And as I go around the world, I'm gonna go to a special country and a special people that I haven't covered yet. Been waiting, been saving it. Talk about none other than Australia, the land down under, and the great Australian people. The thing about it is, when you talk about football hooliganism, I don't know that it's so developed as such. I'm gonna open it up for the Australian lads to comment. The thing about it is, I look at my statistics. I get a lot of views from Australia. I got a lot of support, I got a lot of love, no hatred, I've been welcomed all over Australia, from Tasmania to Sydney. And I'm looking to cash in that brotherhood, if I may. <laughs> so here's the thing in the comments below, I'm gonna open it up, baby. And this might be a new series, this might be my new livelihood. I might have to expose what goes on down under the football game. You got some football hooligan firms, but the thing is rugby is the thing over there. And the way I see it, rugby like NFL. A rugby team or NFL team will whip a hooligan firm most anyone. It may be except the Grand Chess, the great Manchester United <laughs> Red Army. They got so much numbers, they overwhelmed them, Jack, and maybe had to use a couple of weapons and tool it up a little bit. But in the meantime, in between time, it looked to me like rugby is the thing in Australia. I don't know. I can tell you that ever since I saw Mad Max, I've been wanting to go. And I'm gonna get me one of them cars like Mel Mr. Melvin Gibson had, Jack. And I wanna go see where that Lord Humongous is. And if I see Lord Humongous, hey, wah, 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 bop. The man said, hey, the Ayatollah rock and roller, not anymore, huh? <laughs> Bell Boy Diablo on tour to Australia coming soon. Yeah, thank you to all my Australian supporters.